Hey guys, I wanted to come through today and talk about something a little bit controversial, but um, I think it's something that's important and I think it's something that we should talk about. I want to talk about black business, right? Specifically black business, black events, black things, right? There's something as black people that we don't do. And I think where it originates from, it originates from the, the way that black cultures raised us. And that's complain, right? Black people generally do not complain. Um, you know, we, we, we never lash out. We never say when something is wrong um, overtly. So if we do, it's sort of hush, hush, etc., etc. And I wanted to come through and speak about it because, sorry about that. What happened to me is I bought something from a black business. Um, and when I got bought food, when I got home, it did not taste good at all. Um, and I complained to my friend. I was like, this food is terrible. I'm really unhappy about it. I was looking forward to it. It was my Sunday meal. Um, I'm really unhappy about it. And I put it in the fridge, right? So after a while, I was like, you know what? Let me actually go back to that business and tell them exactly how I feel. Let me not post it on Twitter. Let me actually go back, right? So I get back to that business and I give the lady the food and I'm like, listen, I'm not happy about this and that and that and that. And that. Basically, I'm a white woman. I'm Leanne or Stacy, right? And when I'm done, the woman is like, you know what? Let me prepare good food for you. Um, here you go. She gives me the great new food. She apologizes. But not only that, she says to me, thank you for the feedback because in future, I'll know not to compromise. Because she said to me, no, we're just opened. We're not quite ready. So we quickly did it because you were there already. But you know, in future, I'll not compromise on my service. And I was just like, oh, okay. Um, the way she took it was very edifying. Like to her, it actually improved her business. And we don't do it enough. Like so many times I've been to so many black things where we don't do it enough. I mean, a simple thing like at a, a black church where someone's not happy about something, they'll be so afraid to tell the pastor that I don't think things should be going like this because They'll be afraid of being judged or whatever the case is. But we notice that in the white culture, they're so quick to it. Like if the coffee comes and it's not cold enough, they're so quick to be like, listen, the coffee's not cold enough. And when we think about it, we usually think it's a bad thing, but it's a good thing because they get to improve and become better. And that's how they attain excellence. You know, it's through that feedback that they draw the feedback and they're able to know what to improve on, how to actually improve. And I think we definitely need the culture, obviously constructive, but we need the culture of us actually complaining, especially amongst black people, saying when things are not right, calling them out, and expecting improvement. You know, so, so the whole thing about it is that when people are in their businesses or when people work in their business, so many times they're unable to see what's wrong in that business because they spend so much time working on it. But when someone comes to an outside perspective and tells them they're able actually to improve and actually change it. So it's just a thought. Whenever you go into a business, if you're a black person, do lash out, do become like Stacy, do be like Leanne and tell them that the coffee's not cold enough or you're not happy about the air conditioning blasting or the speakers are not crisp enough. Always give those suggestions because that actually helps improve the business. We think sometimes it's a cocky, wrong thing to do, but in actual fact, it's the thing that separates the good and the perfect. So yeah, that's my thought. Hope you all are having a great Sunday and hope you have an excellent week coming ahead. Cheers.